Okay, how about that? Okay, how about that? Okay. okay, that's better. So bear with me a little bit, folks. Um, I'm really doing this uh, half-ass on my phone here, but we've got a real quick update coming. My Waffle House is almost here. Zach's Waffle House is already here. Uh, we're in Georgia. Um, that's what's going on. Okay. So long story short, uh, we've got a uh, severe thunderstorm outbreak, a tropical weather uh, system in route. It's PTC9. Now, this is going to be the fastest live stream I've ever done. Unlock my door. It's already unlocked. Hello? Okay. It's unlocked. I don't know what that's about. Anyway, um, he's probably going to go to the wrong room. Uh, so my DoorDash is in route, and we've got this uh, hurricane that's what's well, probably going to be a hurricane coming. You can see above me the radar Omega satellite loop, and you can see the forecast cone. You got Humberto over there, and then Imalda over here on the left. And these are both. I don't know. Let me look. Thanks, by the way. Five oh nine. I think I just put a hole in the drywall too. Whoops. Damn near it. Oh, that's not good. Okay. Well, anyway, we're not doing too good here. So, but uh, anyway. It's been a busy day, and again, this, that's why this is so short and it's chaotic. We're going to have more organized streams in the morning, but a lot has changed. We started off with what we thought was going to be just a slam dunk. It's going to be Charleston. Back up, back up, back up, back up. At first, everybody said we were wrong and said it was going out to sea. We're going to eat those words if it goes out to sea, but I don't think it's going to. And then it started converging on Charleston and then South Carolina, and it still looks like that, but there's some model discrepancies that say otherwise. And, oh, hey, there's my food. Right? Oh, Jesus, thank God. Okay, well, Zach's here with my food. That means I put the phone in the phone holder. Huh? What do you think? Um, I'm just, this is a very uh, quite informal here. That's the right food, right? Last time we were in a hotel room together, I know that didn't sound very good, but we uh, we glued a bunch of stuff together, and I think I got high off the fumes. There's a chair. My lights don't half work either. Is there any silverware in here? No, I don't know. I got spare silverware, if yours is missing. But anyway, that's what we're looking at. We got this tropical system. There's two of them out there. I really don't care about that one on the right, that Humberto. That's just, that's trash um, for us. That's going to cur. It's going to look like it's coming toward the U.S., and then it's going to curve and not be our problem. Um, I don't even know if Bermuda. Yeah, maybe for Bermuda. Um, but the one that looks like a giant, I don't even know what to call this. But you can just tell by this cone, this goofy-looking cone that there's a lot of uncertainty here um, this is the storm down here by haiti um, and one of the issues i think today have been that this has been interacting with land and it's i don't want to say it's harmed it but you can see the convection really it, it's it's there and it's robust but it's kind of loose it's almost like it doesn't look very mature this is working right here um so this is going to take a minute to get going right now this isn't anything it's uh basically just post tropical oh wait it is is it tropical depression is this tropical depression i haven't looked at anything okay do any weather nerds know if this is a depression yeah over noise cancellations really working well there you know does anybody in the chat know if this is a depression because sometimes in the AP, the this data, it'll say tropical depression, but it's just a PTC. I don't don't start asking me the technical differences between this. Do you, what's the difference? He says he might have depression. <laughs> okay. Anyway, it doesn't matter. We've got this uh, storm down here. It's going to be a, a tropical storm. It looks like by. God. 
two days. It's not a tropical depression. It's a potential tropical cyclone, but it's supposed to reach off the depression status probably right here. Lame. Lame. Okay, so this thing's not going to be a tropical storm until it gets up here by the southern Bahamas, it looks like. Yeah, a lot of these weather apps are calling this uh, like a depression and lots of stuff because it's uh, the way the National Hurricanes uh, here. I'll just visit the website. The way the National Hurricane Center, yeah, it's just PTC, post tropical or potential tropical cyclone nine. Um, this is what was 94L. It's the way that the National Hurricane Center distributes this data that there's really no way to uh, differentiate PTC from tropical depression. It, it doesn't matter. This, it's it's going to be a depression anyway, just like my life. Um, but and Aiden's apparently, but this is going to move up this cone, and I know it's a little small there, but where we have the the uncertainty is up here. You can see this is a giant. I don't know. Wart on the end of the cone. I don't. Is this even, is this even a cone? Like, I don't know what the hell they call this, but whatever. It goes. I mean, it goes from Tampa to Virginia Beach. Like, that doesn't. That doesn't help. But it shows Category 1 hurricane by 2 p.m. on the 29th, which is going to be Monday. We're now looking at, we're way ahead of, of this damn thing now. This We're looking at 2 p.m. on the, this is going to be a, a Tuesday landfall now, I think. So plans real quick because I'm going to eat. Uh, but just to make this real short because I've already gone over. See, this was going to be like a 45-minute long live stream, and then I decided I was going to order Waffle House. We went to the wrong hotel. Um again <laughs> the waffle house was we're here we waited 45 minutes at the in the lobby down here to check in but the food's on time is the food hot how's, pork, uh, how's the waffle house pork chop it's okay. better oh i wouldn't order that you people order a waffle house pork chop yeah zach's here you can follow if you on the uh projectweatherei.org or com.com page. If you go to the bottom, uh, Zach's got a link. Yes, he has his hotel room at his own Y. Am I missing something here? No, we're dead together. Oh, yeah, yeah totally. It, YouTube must know that there was something behind that because it blocked that comment. What? Someone saying, are you sharing a hotel room? And YouTube blocked it. Are you serious? I'm dead serious. That's hilarious. Sorry, dead ass. <laughs> <laughs> this is Atlanta. We got to have the right terminology here. Um, but that's basically all we got. So what our plan is, um, yeah, Aiden's up there. I don't even know if it, let's see if his beacon's on. I don't even know where he's at. He's depressed. Yeah, look at that, guys. Aiden's in Chicago. Oh, Jesus. Ooh. All right, we need to watch him and make sure he moves because that's not a good place. Why is he there? You know, he has a bad habit of stopping it. I'm a little concerned here. Oh, that dot hasn't moved. He was just talking. Yeah. Well, you know what? He could have went into that gas station and been out in the amount of time he was talking. It is near. It is near a gas station. He's <laughs> alive. Well, we lost one. Uh, we're, applications are open. We've got a spot on the team. If anybody wants to be part of this project, uh, Aiden just dropped out. <laughs> <laughs> Might have died. I'm not sure. <laughs> but anyway, real quick, here's the uh, forecast and model intensity. They all say tropical storm, but it's probably going to be Category 1 hurricane. I mean, her, I trust the, the National Hurricane Center more than this graph. It is backwards. What? This is ridiculous. Like, I need to figure out how to use this software. Hold on. My, the th whole thing is backwards. Mir, why would you want... There you go. All right. So this basically just shows, you know, what I said. Whatever I said. I forgot already. I don't know what you call this, but it's the... It's from Tropical Tidbits, and it just shows you the int forecast intensity over hours. So, whatever. Graph. Um, that's what we're looking at, but it's probably going to hedge up here in this Category 1 state. Um... 
hold on a second. I don't know what tabs I have open, so I gotta move the camera. Oh, jeez. Is this? Oh. I think I'm just double showing you, aren't I? Oh, yeah, I was double showing you. Okay, cool. So that's now I know how that works. Great. Sorry, this is so half ass, just like every live stream we do, but it seems to be working so far. So if it's not broke, we ain't fixing it. But that's kind of where we're at, and that's where we're expecting this thing to kind of go. So tomorrow morning, we're going to determine a deployment zone, which I'll illustrate with the pen uh, first. And this is a little trick. I do with radar omega to clear the map i just go to like tropical hmon and then just don't click anything and it'll just give you a clear map oh, it's kind of a little hack but this is what we're looking at so our uh likely area so we're gonna probably try to set up home base somewhere between savannah and charleston somewhere in there um not sure exactly where and from there we're gonna branch out so we're gonna have a group or groups go north and of course south and then they'll start working inward kind of like that um, but tomorrow we're not really looking at deploying anything tomorrow it's going to be just get into position because we are apparently early just like all the time we always think we're going to be late and then we end up early um, because tomorrow the storm's going to be like here by the bahamas uh, actually oh my god dude this thing slowed down even more it's showing it at like like the the central Bahamas on the twenty eighth at two p.m., which is That's Sunday. Sunday. Yeah, yeah, and it was last night's guidance said it was going to landfall Monday morning. Yeah. Holy heck! Oh wait a minute! Yeah, wait, no, that is the current cone. Oh my god! The first of October, it's still meandering around. We're gonna run out of battery. Like we're gonna have to hook up a generator to these damn cameras. You know, we could probably deploy these cameras and then just go home and come back in a week, and it'll still the freaking storm is still gonna be. Yeah, that was just sitting there thinking, go back home for two, three weeks. Yeah, and the damn storm's gonna. Oh my god. Okay. Well, anyway, so no cameras tomorrow. Nope, calling it off. No cameras tomorrow, so it's a vacation tomorrow, I guess. All right. No. I'm sure Aiden's pleased that he's driving all night for this. <laughs> so he's, yeah. So tomorrow is canceled. Nothing tomorrow. We'll do like, I'll do some social media stuff. I'll update you. We'll, we'll do something. Sunday would be a good day probably for cameras uh, to start going out the 28th. Where's the stupid thing going to be out on the 28th? Jesus Christ. Freaking offshore of Miami on the 28th still. So, all right, so Sunday night cameras, maybe, when Monday morning cameras, so. Okay, that's what I got, and I don't know what else to tell you guys, so I'm going to just go eat my food now. So, thanks for watching, folks. It's been fun. We'll give you an update uh, tomorrow in the morning, and I'll put out some more information tonight once these new models come in. So, thanks, everybody. It's food time, and uh, we've been live for... 13 minutes and 42 seconds longer than I planned on it. So, all right. Good night, everybody. Thanks again. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. We've got a we got a landfall denier here. Hang on. Hold on. I'm joking. I, I know that comment wasn't meant to be like that, but hold on. Do we have a TV meteorologist in the chat? I can't even read it. You guys, my look at what my chat is doing. It's just hopping all over the place but anyway somebody said they thought well is this going to get sheared off or something i don't know i doubt that it, i doubt it because the uh um most of the good model there's a lot of i think someone else is concerned too um, uh, well that's a good start anyway um but yeah so that's that uh most of the good models there's a lot of crap models but the good models see what i mean there's like four radios in this bag that are all on i hear this one's on too cripes 
Um, the, the reliable ones are showing a landfall. So I would expect some sort of a landfall or very close to it. doesn't matter if it actually gets landfall or on land. It just If it sits close to land and just spins and just floods everything, it's not going to matter. I mean, we could be looking at a flooding disaster more than we could a hurricane here. So sorry that the food interrupted. Go ahead and post your questions uh, on my Facebook page, I guess, um, if you want in the comments. And I'll probably not answer them because I won't see them, but I'll try in good faith. So good night, everybody. And I'll be back in the morning.